You're from Chicago, just like me, huh? Yes. Where did you grow up? I uh, grew up on the north side, but I was a north side child of south side parents, so it was all very complicated. Oh, yeah, because that's like almost like two different places, because I'm from the south side, I'm like the north side. That's been like a whole nother state to me. So I understand that. And did you ever go to the Wrigley Field a lot? Uh, yeah, lived near Wrigley Field, uh, went there all the time as a kid, um, because my mom became a Cubs fan, even though all of our family roots were as Sox fans. So I'm more Sox fan than Cubs fan, uh. but I've been to Wrigley Field more than I've been to the various parks where the White Sox have played. <laughs> and then eventually worked there for a summer. Oh, you did? Yeah, yeah, one summer it was like, you know, I, I, I mean, I had dreams. Mm -hmm. I had dreams, Jennifer. And, uh, <laughs> but uh, sometimes you have to pause those dreams to like pay rent and stuff. That's and, right. Uh, I live near Wrigley Field, like, you know what? This is the summer, I'm gonna work there. And, um, and I'm, uh, I'm, I'm doing concessions and, uh, and not having the best time because I keep thinking about, you know, the dreams. And, um, <laughs> and then one day, uh, you know, a guy is in line and is like, oh my God, Brendan. And it was a guy who I had lived with um, when we had a housing issue for the first two weeks in college. I lived with him for two weeks. Mm -hmm. You know, suburban dude, clearly now doing very well for himself, dressed fairly fancy, all yuppied up. I'm like, oh, hey, Todd, what's up? Oh, wow. Anyway, so uh, let me get uh, four hot dogs and uh, four beers. I'm like, oh, yeah, sure, 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 man. Great to see you. Blah, blah, blah. I give it all to him. And then as he walks away, I hear him say, oh, man, I can't believe I just bought hot dogs from a guy I lived with in college. That was my last day at Wrigley Field. <laughs> <laughs> Now, you said you, you worked at a bowling alley growing up. What, what exactly did you do? Um, so, on the uh, faraway north side that you never wanted to go to, I get it, there was a bowling alley <laughs> called Southport Lanes, um, which was an old-fashioned bowling alley where they had human pin setters. It was like a high school job you would do. There was four lanes. We'd all take two lanes each. Um, and, you know, I weighed 90 pounds, and 10 of those pounds were the braces I was wearing. And um, <laughs> it was a thrilling, incredibly dangerous job. I was gonna ask, was it dangerous? Oh yeah. So you never, did you ever get hit by the bowling ball? Uh, yes, absolutely. I remember one time specifically where a, a, a pin literally helicoptered around my face oh, off my the God. walls in like, ping, 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 like, like a Yosemite Sam bullet. And, uh, <laughs> and, then, and then faded there and I was like, I almost died. <laughs> if you like this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel. Check your local listings or visit JenniferHudsonShow.com to see when you can watch full episodes in your area. And don't forget to sign up for the newsletter.